my name is Dr. Thomas Fahey. I'm the Chief of Endocrine Surgery here at the New York Presbyterian Hospital Weill Cornell Medical Center. Uh, endocrine surgery is the treatment of tumors, both benign and malignant, as well as other conditions uh, of the thyroid, parathyroid, adrenal, pancreas, and other gastrointestinal endocrine uh, organs. Uh, here at the New York Presbyterian Weill Cornell Medical Center, we treat these conditions minimally invasively whenever possible. Thyroid surgery can be done under local anesthesia. Uh, the program here uh, is focused on the management of thyroid tumors and thyroid cancer in a multidisciplinary fashion uh, so that in addition to surgery, there is support for the adjuvant treatment of thyroid cancer uh, in a systematic way. It is well known that uh, volume is an important factor in uh, outcomes in thyroid surgery. Uh, here we have a very high volume of thyroid surgery, uh, over 200 uh, cases per year, uh, which uh, allows us to treat uh, patients in the most efficient and effective manner possible. Adrenal tumors are approached uh, via minimally invasive techniques uh, almost exclusively. Uh, we specialize in the multidisciplinary treatment of uh, complicated patients such as those with pheochromocytoma where we approach these patients with a team of doctors, including hypertension specialists, uh, as well as surgeons and, and uh, intensive care specialists for the preoperative and postoperative management of these patients. Pancreatic endocrine tumors are approached via a minimally invasive uh, approach whenever possible, uh, especially patients with uh, tumors such as an insulinoma can be approached via a minimally invasive approach but uh, more malignant tumors can be approached using standard open uh, techniques as well. Minimally invasive techniques are a great advance uh, in surgery over the past decade and have allowed patients to uh, benefit in a variety of ways, including a more rapid return to work and to uh, routine daily life, as well as uh, cosmetic benefits uh, through the use of smaller incisions and therefore smaller scars.